Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. This is Side Dental Vlogs, and uh, today's video is very very important because this video is for those people who want to take BDS as admission. I know there is a lot of negativity about BDS that there is no jobs, there is no vacancy, there is no government job after BDS. But this is not actually so because uh, if you see us like we are working since so many years, uh, the current situation is what like the negativity is more rather than. people searching for options okay so the negativity is inside the minds only okay if you just take out the negativity and bring positivity inside so what will happen you will be able to shine in your life so today i will tell you all the details about bds what you have to do in the course what are the job options after bds and what is the like course uh, like what to expect from this course basically when you are doing this so first of all guys uh, uh i would like to tell you ki bds is the meaning of bds is bachelor of dental surgery and there is a higher degree than bds which is known as master of dental surgery so in master of dental surgery there are uh, nine uh, subjects specialties where you can do your mds and before that i would like to tell and throw light on bds itself so the uh, bds fees in a government college is somewhere around 50000 to 1 lakh rupees per annum and in a private college if you are getting it's about 4 to 6 lakhs some colleges is 2 and a half lakhs per annum so right now uh, there are 300 approximately 330 colleges dental colleges in india and every batch there are 100 students approximately i'm telling so uh, suppose uh, if you uh, what what you will do after bds the first thing uh, it comes in your mind or a parents mind ki mera beta beti mds karega ya bds karega so what they will do after that so first of all what to expect from this course number one point this course is not as easy as you think it is difficult yes along with theory you have to do practical also it is equivalent to mbbs means not in terms of uh, your degree but in terms of the mehnat or the hard work which you have to put so it's not like that you just go entry into the college and uh, just we come out after taking the B, uh, degree okay if you do like that you won't be you will get negativity only you won't be able to do anything you won't be able to practice you won't be able to, able to work on patients so hard work is must first of all so when you enter in the first year of the college uh, you have to do a lot of things like uh, making cubes from plaster and then you have to do wire bending in second year and you have to do cooth tooth carving so guys that is very important that doesn't mean that you have to do all all those things in your entire life that is just a practical which you have to do or uh, that doesn't mean that you have to do it in your entire life okay that is just to improve your dexterity your patience everything okay so entire curriculum is made like that so right, uh, till second year you have to only study and do practicals from third year you will be able to work on the patients or see the patients okay that totally totally depends upon your interest how you are managing the patients how you are talking to the patients suppose you are a north indian working in uh, studying in south india and you don't know the language you have to learn the language a little bit in order to interact with the patients right so there are different colleges in different various parts of the country and everybody knows english or hindi nowadays it's not like that ki abhi netflix or flix aa gaya hai so it's not like ki language barrier and all that is all stupid bullshit okay language barrier is never a barrier okay then second is uh, second thing how much you have to work on how much you have to study every day you have to study approximately minimum to minimum 4 to 5 hours every day in order to gain good knowledge from good books see in bds uh, suppose you are in class 12th right now ab jo bhi video dekh raha hoga so in the bds you will be getting many good books standard books which like uh, of good authors okay but you will be also getting some other books which are known as guide books or uh, just you read them and pass so if you read guide books and those kind of books you won't be able to gain deeper knowledge so if you are not getting deeper knowledge you won't be able to shine in life you won't be able to get good knowledge you won't be able to get uh, the deep knowledge the deep inside what is there actually inside the tooth inside the can cranial nerves blood vessels okay so you have to read from golden standard textbooks while studying your bds chahe kitna bhi koi senior whatever they tell you ki okay don't read from this book you won't be able to pass never listen to them read from very good books all the books are there in the library okay and you can purchase them also now uh, in third year and finally you have to work on patients there will be quotas so those quotas are not bad for you this is good for you actually in order to learn the work after that you will be doing your internship where you 
if you are in a government college you will get some stipend if you're in even if you're in a private college you will get stipend but not in all colleges okay and in private colleges the stipend is little less okay because the private colleges are not funded from the government so the management will pay you less so after bds what we have to do is you can do there are many options after bds you can first option is BD, uh, you have to do you or you may like if you want you can do mds so mds you can give neat and you can join mds in the various branches like oral medicine and radiology oral pathology prosthodontics orthodontics oral and maxillofacial surgery community dentistry and uh, pedodontics prosthodontics and these are the periodontics these are the various branches of dentistry in which you can do your mds each and every branch has its own uh, speciality okay it's not like that koi bhi branch kharab hai okay all the branches are good it all depends upon your hard work your dedication your uh, efforts what you have put while doing the md so after passing the mds you can get a uh, private job in a private college which is not that easy nowadays because there are a lot of md students which have passed and they have not uh, all the vacancies are always not there okay but after that you will get a few search so what is my suggestion is after you pass your bds or mds open your own clinic in a native place your native locality where you are staying suppose if you are staying in a village then don't, don't think of going into a urban city and then opening uh, a clinic okay so you have to open your clinic in your own native place and if it is your own place your own home then it is nothing better than that because you don't have to pay the rent okay and after opening the clinic you will get around initial starting around we may get 10000 or 15000 rupees but with uh, years passing by and 2 years 3 years ke baad your income will definitely definitely increase okay uh, and i have made a video also you can watch this uh, how much a bds dental surgeon can earn okay minimum in from his dental clinic okay so you can see those videos there are a lot of videos about income and how to increase your patients so this is the first scope like opening your clinic and then suppose you are going uh, for the job in the morning and evening you are run your own clinic okay even if you don't have your own clinic you can work in somebody's clinic and uh, you can get some amount of money from that second option is government job government job is also very little uh, scarcity is there now because uh, a lot of dentists they didn't get jobs while passing so there is scarcity but in some states they really uh, take out few seats vacancies like recently in odisha some 200 to 250 people got uh, into uh, various phcs and chcs means health centers okay as a dental graduates so it's not like that ki government job nikalta nahi hai you just have to search okay third part is uh, usually uh, suppose there are some uh, institutes uh, which are related to the army like esic and uh, you can also get a uh, job in various steel factories like bhel and sail so these uh, these jo institute these organizations they also take out few vacancies uh, in reg- at regular intervals okay now last is the army dental core co and army dental core you have to give neat mds and if your rank is within 500 to 1000 or within 600 700 and if you get a call you definitely can go for the army dental co and that is a very good option and very good salary so it's not like that ki what i'm telling is very easy to get okay you have to work hard towards it and if you read from all those good books you will have enough knowledge to clear the interviews clear the exams okay and various kind of jr ships and sr ships are also coming in aims and different uh, government colleges where you can apply for it so it's not like uh, see koi bhi successful dentist ke paas aap ja ke dekhiye so they are minting money okay 5 lakhs to 6 lakhs is nothing for them okay every day one implant or after 3 4 days every you will put one implant okay so one implant cost is only 25000 rupees the entire month salary will come from one patient itself so don't think that bds is a very uh, like a worst option it's a very good option if you click it in a right way if you put hard uh, hard work in your initial years definitely definitely you are going to shine in your life that is for sure and there are many other scopes my entire channel is full of scopes in dentistry and various government jobs how to clear government jobs how to crack your mds bds how to increase the income from your clinic where to open a clinic in a rural area and urban area so all these videos are there in my channel you can search whatever doubt you are having in your mind you can just search in youtube sai dental vlogs and suppose you want to know the income of after mds okay just type income after mds sai dental vlogs we'll get three four videos about it or if you want to know the 
various scopes in dentistry or how to go abroad after BDS, you just type side dental vlog, how to go abroad after BDS, you will get many options like Australia, USA, Canada. So these all videos I have made even for UAE, UAE I have made. So you can search all these videos and from there uh, you can easily get some idea, some knowledge about this entire field of dentistry. So if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and uh, please subscribe to this channel and you can follow me on Instagram also, sci underscore dental is my Instagram ID. Thank you. Have a very good day. Take care.